Hi everyone, I'm Sajal Nigam. In this video, I want to introduce you to a project I've been working on and I call it Gardon. It's an open source browser extension designed to bring compliance and security closer to where developers actually work. Let me start with a truth we all know. In Kubernetes environment, small configuration errors often turn into big production problems. A missing resource limit, a privileged container, an unscanned image, or a misplaced secret. Any of these can cause an outage, open a security hole, or violate compliance rules. These mistakes are easy to make, but they are often caught too late in the development cycle. Now, uh, there are existing solutions that help identify these issues. Tools like Cubescape, Open Policy Agents, Kiverno, and many more. They do a great job analyzing manifest, enforcing policies, and scanning workloads. But here's the problem. They usually operate after the fact. After you have written the code, after you have pushed the changes, after it's already merged into your pipeline. By that time, the feedback loop is slow, the context is gone, and the cost of fixing those mistakes have already gone up. You might get a, get a CI failure or compliance warning uh, from a post-deployment scanner, but now you're backtracking, rewriting, and revalidating. That's, that, that delay doesn't just cost time, it actually costs trust, velocity, and developer flow. And that's exactly where Gardon comes in. Gardon brings those uh, same security, compliance checks to the earliest point in your workflow, right into your browser. It's an open source Chrome extension that uh, automatically scans Kubernetes YAML files as you view or review them on the GitHub or GitLab. You don't need to deploy anything, integrate with your CI or send data anywhere. Just open a YAML file and Gardon instantly highlights misconfigurations, explains why they matter and even suggest fixes. It's about shifting security left, not as a slogan, but as a concrete actions developer can take every day. So here is what, what makes Gardon powerful. It's fast, lightweight, and fully local. With the new background fetch helper, it can validate multi-document YAMLs or pull in configurations directly from GitHub or Bitbucket. That means you can catch problems even before a pull request is created. No waiting for a build or an external scan. At its core, Gardon uses a rule engine, uh, which is flexible. Uh, it's pattern-driven validator that supports nested fields, wildcards, and schema-based logic. You can enforce custom organization policies like disallowing privileged containers, enforce, enforcing resource limits, or banning latest image tags all defined as a simple JSON or YAML rules. So if your team already uses Kiverno or an open, open policy agent, Gardon fits in right there. It's, it's improved Kiverno importer lets you reuse your existing policies seamlessly, preserving audits and mutation logic so you don't start from scratch. Also, Gardon doesn't just flag problems, it teaches. Every violation now comes with an explain button that links directly to recognized frameworks like CIS Kubernetes Benchmarks and NIS TSP 800-190. Instead of a woke error message, you can clearly you can clearly see a reasoning why it matters and how to fix it properly. And when you when you're ready to fix it, Gardon provides before and after YAML previews, helping you visualize the corrections before applying it. So it's not just validation; it's instance and in-context guidance. So this approach transforms how team thinks about compliance. Instead of waiting for CICD or runtime scanners to point out errors, Gardon empowers developers to fix issues as they write and review code. So that's faster pull request, cleaner commits, and fewer security regressions without interrupting the developer flow. Gardon, it's, it's in here to replace tools like uh, Cubescape or Kiverno, it complements them. So those tools remain essential for deep cluster level enforcements, or runtime scannings and auditing, 
But Gardon focuses on the earliest, which is developer facing stage, the point where prevention is easiest and cheapest. By working ha hand in hand with existing systems, it helps team achieve full life cycle compliance from developer desktop to production cluster. Any robot, it's completely open source. Every rule, every check, and every feature is transparent and community driven. So you can audit the code, extend it, or adapt for your own workflow. So platform engineering teams, uh, the SRE teams can even host shared rules, repositories, so everybody, everybody in the organization follow the same policies automatically. The roadmap ahead builds on this foundation and adding plugins, support for custom rules modules, uh, Git sync team policy packs, CICD integrations for pre-merge checks and dashboards that visualizes violation trends over time. And looking further, I'm experimenting with AI-driven auto fixes where the system learns from your environment and suggest best fit corrections automatically. The vision is simple. Make Kubernetes configurations validations instant, intelligent, and developer first. So Gardon isn't just another linter. It's a shift in mindset. It turns security from a gatekeeper into a guide. It transforms compliance from a burden into a learning tool. And it helps developers deliver with confidence, knowing that safety, performance, and compliance are built in, not bolted on. So if you're a Kubernetes engineer, a DevOps specialist, or part of a platform engineering team, I invite you to try it out. Download this extension from Google Chrome, load it in your browser, and see what it can do. Try your own YAMLs, customize few rules, and experience how fast compliance can feel when it happens before the commit. Also, if you have ideas and interested to be part of this development, please visit my code repository by scanning the QR code on the screen or by clicking the link given below. Thanks again. I'm Sajal Nigam and this is Gardon helping you and your team shift left, stay secure and build confidently. Thank you for watching.